in the eerie shadows of a moonless night. A chilling silence blankens the earth. As you tune in to this spine-tingling audio series, you are transported into a realm where the boundaries between spirits and monsters blur, unleashing untold horrors upon the unexpecting world. The whispers of vengeful spirits intertwine with the gnarling growls of monstrous creatures. Their ghastly alliance awakened a primordial evil that hungers for human souls. With each haunting episode, you will be drawn deeper into the heart of this malevolent darkness. Where despite mortals struggle to survive while the line between friend and foe vanishes. Brace yourself, dear listener, for within these episodes, you will experience firsthand the dread and terror that arises when spirits and monsters join forces in a dance of pure, unadulterated horror. So, your name's Eyeless Jack. Yes, that is my name. What's your name? My name is Megami Fushiguro. You have a great name, Megami Fushiguro. I am envious of it. Envy it? Why would you envy my own name? It's not that special. It, that's not important. What's important is that you shouldn't be out here by yourself. There's lots of dangerous- Curse spirits and monsters. I heard your whole spiel already. And plus, I already knew. So you're deliberately staying out here, knowing that there's cursed spirits and monsters roaming around freely. You know they can kill you, right, if you don't see them? Trust me, Megami Fushiguro. I know these monsters, these abominations out here. They can kill me. I do know this. But do I seem scared to you? Uh, um, no, I, I, I guess not. You don't seem scared at all. But that still doesn't matter. I'm out here trying to save everybody. It's not safe for normal people to be out here. <laughs> I'm not a normal person. I wouldn't even consider myself... A person at this point. I've been alive a lot longer than you think I have. I've seen all sorts of monsters and all sorts of what you call curse spirits throughout my life. And I've slowly became a monster myself. You don't seem like a monster to me. I'm not sensing any curse energy off of you. Nor I don't sense any hostility. You seem like a normal human, like myself. That is where you are mistaken. I'm not... A normal human like you, or any other of the other humans that are around here. I've done heinous things 
things that if I were told you, you would hurl on the spot. So you're a criminal? No, I am no criminal. There isn't no crime if you're not caught and there's no evidence left over. Um, the way you're talking right now is making me feel like you've done something already. So if you have done something already, you better tell me. Otherwise, I'll have to deal with you myself. <laughs> you really want to know? Fine. You want to know exactly what I am? You want to know exactly who and what I've done? I'll tell you. A long time ago, I was human, just like yourself. I was going to school, and I wanted to be a doctor. I've studied so hard. And then, one night, everything changed. I started to feel my body change the way that no human should be ever be feeling. My body changed so much. My skin, though it was pale now, is a gray tint. And my blood and saliva turn into a black thick tar. And I started to crave human insides. Mostly of human kidneys and pancreases. I was an insatiable, insatiable hunger. And so, Using my knowledge I have as a surgeon, I did exactly what you think I have did. I got open innocent humans and cut their kidneys out of their bodies. And I would eat them either for a leader or right in front of their bodies so they can see. Oh my god. You eat people? That's disgusting. You're nothing but a murderer. I will deal with you right now. I welcome you to try. For most of my victims who fought back never saw the next day. <laughs> and at that moment, Megami Fushiguro and Eyeless Jack took their stances. One user, using his passed down curse technique, and the other, using nothing but his strength and his wit. Only one person will stand victorious. Ten Shadows Technique Nui! At that moment, Megami uses his Shikigami, Nui, to fly on top of a nearby building, getting the high ground advantage. But... What? I told you, Megami Fushiguro. <laughs> I'm no ordinary person. Eyeless Jack seamlessly leaps towards Megami, speed blitzing right in front of him and knocking him down on his back with a single punch. And I thought the rumor was true about you sorcerers around here. I thought you were all supposed to be strong. But you're just weak! <gasps> Rapid escape! How the hell did he get up there so fast? And why is he so strong? What the hell is going on here? 
And why am I the only one facing this person right now? What's wrong, Fushiguro? You're running away like a coward. And I thought these sorcerers were supposed to be brave. Come back and fight me! As Eyeless Jack rips through the barrier of rabbits from Megami's rabbit escape. <clears throat> what the hell? Ten Shadows technique. The whale's unknown abyss. Megami uses a combination of his Nue and Toad Shikigami called the Well's Unknown Abyss, shooting the combinated Shikigami right through the rabbit escape and knocking Eyeless Jack backwards into a wall. And now, to finish you- <clears throat> What? Why- What is happening? <laughs> I have to admit, that was a strong attack. But you didn't see what I did before I got launched into that wall. When you launched that creature at me, right before I got sent back, I threw one of my Anastasia needles right into your body. And now, you're feeling the effect. No, I... have... to... fight it. <sighs> Megumi Fushiguro lands onto the ground, unconscious because of the Anastasia now running through his body, and towering over him would be Eyeless Jack, victorious. And now, I think it's time for my reward. <laughs> <laughs>